Hello and welcome to self-hosted how-to today. Very simple, we're just going to be installing Docker on Debian. So we'll do that real quick here. So we're going to log in. All right, so from here, uh, it's just one command actually. Um, so it's got wget dash q. The q stands for quiet mode. That means we're not going to, there's not going to be any extra output. Uppercase O with a dash at the end essentially means we're going to write the output to standard out instead of saving it to a file right so basically this fetches the install script from docker it's going to i'll show you that in a second here and it's going to print it out right so where do we get it we're going to get it from docker which is hosted at get.docker.io so essentially, if we ran this right now, it would just print out the Docker install script, um, which that's fine. We could do that. We could throw that into a file, um, but we could just pipe this output to sh and run the script, right? So we're going to go ahead and do that. It's going to download the script, and then it's going to run it. Right now, it's running it. Now the install, depending on your resources, might take a few minutes, uh, but in general it is pretty quick. This will also install Docker Compose. I didn't even mention, so what is Docker? Docker is a platform for developing, shipping, and running applications in containers. Container is super special. Containers are essentially just lightweight, portable packages that include applications and everything it needs to run. So the code, the library, dependencies, system tools, all this stuff. Unlike virtual machines, though, containers share the host system's kernel. Uh, so it makes them much more faster and efficient. Basically, Docker makes it easy to build an app once and run it anywhere pretty reliably. And that's it. We have installed Docker here. So we can run a Hello World test just to make sure that everything installed properly and Docker is working. We'll do that by just typing Docker run Hello World. And this will query the Docker registry for the Hello World package or container, and it will download it and run it. And there we go. You can see hello from Docker. That means our test is complete. We have Docker installed and we're ready to start using it. 